With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello student, the question is two integers are selected at random from the integers 1 to 11. If their sum is even, find the probability that both integers are odd. So here we are selecting two integers from total 1 to 11 that is 11 integers okay so number of ways of doing is number of select number of ways of selecting number of ways of selecting two integers two integers out of 11 is this is our sample space so number of elements in the sample space would be equal to 11 c2 which is equal to 11 into 10 divided by 2 which is equal to 55 okay so number of element in the sample space would be the all the case okay, all the possible cases of selecting two integers out of 11 which is equal to 55 here now what we need to find out here the sum is even okay it is given so let us define the event let e denotes event of getting a sum event of event of selecting two integers such that selecting two integers out of these in integers we are selecting two integers such that their sum is their sum is even okay now for some for some being even there are two cases first case is both numbers should be even then also the sum would be even so both numbers should be even now out of 1 to 11 the number of even numbers are if you see we have numbers 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 and 11 so number of even numbers here are 1 2 3 4 and 5 okay five numbers are even here so both numbers should be even so possible cases are number of cases this is suppose this is event one so number of elements in event one would be we have to choose one number out of the five even numbers so this is 5c2 which is equal to 10. similarly second case is the sum is also even when both numbers are odd both numbers are odd then also the sum is even so we have number of elements in second case would be out of the six odd numbers available we have to choose any two numbers so this which is done in 62 ways which is equal to this is equal to 15. okay so number of elements in event e is sum of all these cases so this is equal to 25. now we have to find the probability that both integers are odd okay so let we define another event f which is equal to event that both integers are event that both integers event that both integers are odd so event f would contain number of elements out of six odd numbers available we have to choose any two so this is equal to 15 just as the second case so we can say that number of elements in f intersection e is clearly 62 that is equal to 15 so from here we can find now probability of happening of event f when e have happened 
that is probability that both integers are odd when it is given that the sum is even sum of the two numbers is even so which is equal to probability of f intersection e divided by probability of e which is equal to this is 15 and total sample space is of 55 numbers 55 cases 55 ways we have of selecting two integers so this becomes 15 divided by 55 divided by probability of happening of event e would be number of elements number of cases we can say here are 25 so out of 25 out of 55 25 so this is the probability of happening of event e so this becomes equal to 15 divided by 25 which is equal to 3 by 5 okay so this is the final answer that we want to find here thank you for class 6 to 12 itj and neat level trusted by more than 5 crore students download doubt and app today